Lay down. Good boy. Brewer is barely four months old, but he already knows all his basic commands. Can you shake? The golden retriever puppy even knows how to shake hands and say hello, which is why this docile dog was shaken after an unfriendly encounter while walking the rail trail with his owner, Amy Lou Craig. And as we were walking down the trail, a jogger was coming our way. He stopped. I assumed it was to say hi. He asked me to shorten his leash. And I said, what? And he said, shorten his leash or I'll kick him. And I just kind of, I still didn't think he was serious. And then he just took his leg back and kicked him, threw him in the air a few feet. Augusta City Ordinance and Rail Trail Rules require dogs be leashed in public parks. Craig says Brewer was in her control the whole time. He fell on his side, yelped, cried, ran towards me, leg limping, and I just hit the ground with him and held him. Brewer wasn't injured. But Craig says she worries about safety on the trail. The alleged attack on her dog happened in broad daylight. And when she reported it to police, they told her it wasn't the first time something like this had happened. Since this has happened, I've had a handful of people write to me, message me, call me to say that similar things have happened to them or their friends. In fact, Craig's fiance, Jeff Truchon, her family, and her friends took their story to social media. In just 24 hours, Brewer's story has been shared more than 5,200 times. Anytime an event like that happens, to see the hundreds and hundreds of people who are by your right. side to support you is really encouraging. Now, Brewer is doing a lot better today, but police are still investigating to try and find who did this to him. And the Red Barn in Augusta is offering a $500 reward for anyone with information on who might have done this. We're in Augusta, Courtney Sturgeon, WMTW News 8.